is a very relaxed wedding, but they're married. <laughs> There you go, Freddie. Yeah, Matt and Hannah's wedding weekend. Woo -hoo. today in the sight of God and the presence of friends and loved ones to celebrate one of life's greatest moments. We're here to give recognition to the beauty of love that is shared between Matthew Cox and Hannah Diedrich as they join in holy matrimony. <laughs> wow. Like this one's pretty. <laughs> Rugged bride here. <laughs> Lord, we ask for your blessings upon Matt and Hannah as we celebrate this momentous occasion. Grant them happiness and contentment as their two lives become one, as they create a new family and explore the depths of their love for one another. Bless their family and friends and relationships which have supported, strengthened, and sustained them throughout their lives. Bless their home as a place of love and peace. I wish you both much love and happiness as you begin your new journey. Remember to keep lots of laughter in your life and love will follow. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your beautiful bride. I'm ready to party. Are you ready to party? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I want to obviously say thank you to Hannah and Matt for throwing a heck of a shindig. For the weather, praise the Lord. I've known Hannah for about 11 years now. Dude! <laughs> we both hated our life during volleyball season, naturally. We bonded by venting to each other all day, every day. So over time, we vowed to be each other's joy and to make each other laugh when negativity began to overcome us. We started to do it on the court, then in the locker room, and then in our real lives. Since then, you know, Hannah has been my light through everything from college to trying to figure out what we're doing with our lives and moving from South Carolina to Tennessee and opening up a wedding business in 0.2 months. She's been a constant. Her friendship has never wavered. To me, she's my best friend. But she's also my family. I'm such an ugly liar. Okay, now Matt. Matt has been a great friend to me over the years and has saved me from situations more times than I can count. Matt always knows he's in trouble when I call and the first thing I say is, Maddie, I'm in a pickle. Or my personal favorite, oh God, don't tell Nick. I swear I have skills, but Matt has a lot of skills. You have a skill, Yeah. yeah. I'm helping. I'm recording.
important. All right, I'm doing so well. Go ahead. So the first time <laughs> I ever met Matt was because he was a patient of mine when I was in PT school. One day, I was talking about my best friend Hannah who was moving to Tennessee. And he was like, I know Hannah. And I was like, no, you don't. Because how would anyone know Hannah? She was my friend. So over time, Hannah had told me about this cute little mountain man with the beard who let her mom's friend keep her horse in their barn. And then a few days later, Hannah's just messaging him on Facebook and going to the camp and watching the waterfall. And the first day I met Hannah was on a horseback ride a few years ago. After the ride, I thought, she's beautiful, she's tall, she owns her own business, and she loves horses. Check, 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 and check. The rest is history, and here we are. I couldn't have asked for a better partner for Matt, and I love seeing them together. You know, Hannah, she's amazing. She's the best. And I've never met someone who loves, supports, and handles Hannah quite like Matt. It's beautiful. I wish for Matt and Hannah lots of adventures, endless home projects, business endeavors, and maybe a few more cats. Let's all raise our glasses to the beautiful Mr. and Mrs. Cox.